What's going on guys and girls, it's Ghost Robo and welcome to Star Wars Battlefront 2! This game is going to be so freaking good. I love Battlefront 1, we played a ton of it. Let's do the same for Battlefront 2. I think it is going to be fantastic. We get to incorporate all three eras of Star Wars goodness. And we are here with our first chance to play it at home, the beta. There are three uh, multiplayer modes in the beta. You got Galactic Assault, which is the most common scene thing. That is the assault on feed, what you saw at E3. There's Starfighter Assault which is their new retooled space multiplayer madness mode. You've got a strike as well, infantry-based scenarios where one team attacks the other defense objectives. Uh, you also have Arcade, a video of campaign. I want to start off with Arcade. I think it'd be a fun way to start. We're just going to go solo Arcade, uh, see what we can do in some of these battle scenarios. Uh, Dark Side is all that we have, but this is pretty cool because Darth Maul is available, so we're going to go with Wipe Them Out, Onslaught at Thede, Nabu. If you guys want to see more at Battlefront 2, let me know in the comments below. Hit that like button. If there's specific modes or things you want to see, tell me. I will bring them your way. And then when the full game comes out, we'll obviously play the campaign. This one says, Darth Maul wields the power of the dark side to crush the Galactic Republic's pathetic clone army. Time is short, but the power of the Sith is strong. Purge the halls of the palace and leave no troop standing. Alright, so tier 1 is where we want to go. 25 eliminations is what we're gunning for. This reminds me of how I started Battlefront 1. By being Darth Vader, when the game was downloading, the uh, like the little thing you could do was basically Darth Vader crushing everyone on Hoth, and it looks like we're going to be Darth Maul crushing everyone uh, in the Feed Palace. Alrighty, so we can be a B2 RP rocket droid with a twin wrist blaster, but we got Mr. Maul, so of course you know which way we're going. He's got that chokehold, that furious throw, and that spin attack, looking downright devilish here, and also. Looking so gorgeous. I'm playing on PS4 Pro. I think this game looks stunning. It looks absolutely incredible on PC, but I'm going to be uh, playing on console, so I figured that's what we would go with here. And Maul is ready to maul. Grab an extra time on his meter by freaking eviscerating these dudes. Let's force choke everybody in the way, and we're already down to 19 kills to go. You want to kind of stay in the shadows here. It's a dangerous game to play when Maul is on the loose. We're going to throw that saber. As you can see, I have health, and I'm going to try and not get too eaten alive here. Uh-oh, we got, you got a lot of dudes, a lot of dudes, a lot of dudes. Let's slice them. We add time every kill we make, so that's good. Boom, yep, that spin attack, that choke attack, really just wrecking as much as we can and doing our part. Oop, oop, oh yes. Ten kills remaining. I got about half health, so this is shaping up nicely. We're going to use all of our abilities to throw that lightsaber. Ah, get that spin attack, whoa. Somebody is really going ham on me. Yup. Okay. Feeling good about this. Feeling good. How many left? How many left? Five kills remaining. Alright, let's stick to the shadows a little bit. Ooh, yes. That's a good kill we get here. Four kills remaining. And I'm getting some of my health back, which is important. Yes, choke as many as I can see. One kill! And oh god. It's gonna spin in for the saber strike. And we slash him down with all our might. Darth Maul looking absolutely monstrous. Grabbing that victory. A minute, 14 seconds. How many stars? Phil, one, one star? Come on, man. I feel like that was a pretty darn valiant performance. It's a one star performance, but I'm going to give myself a full three because that was freaking awesome. <sighs> I love Darth Maul already. He is absolutely incredible. Heroes vs. Villains are some of my absolute favorite moments of uh, freaking Battlefront 1. I love those. Like the three on threes where you have... Oh, they're so freaking good. Let's open some crates here. Obviously, they're bringing in crates and microtransactions. Uh, but I want to see what they got going on here. So, thanks for playing Battlefront. This is the first crate. And, ooh, nice little crate animation. It's always critical. Guessing these are going to be star cards, right? Um, okay. Combat Enhancer. Han Solo Extended Sharpshooter. Okay. And then, uh, Advanced Engine Upgrade for the Interceptor. Okay, interesting. So, then you can go to characters here. And you can, like, say, hey, let's pick on Solo. Um, every character has unique abilities, gotcha. But then we can also equip star cards and other boosts. So, um, we have this one here. You can see there's a bunch of different ones that you could craft uh, and upgrade as well. So, this increases Sharpshooter for an extra second. So, let's drop that in there. Pretty interesting. Um, and then you can see we also uh, have, like, the Assault class. We've got a card for him. Um, oh, with ability replacement. So regenerate health while this ability is active. And it replaces scan dart. Huh, okay, that sounds cool. Let's just do that just to be a little bit different, a little bit unique. Um, and then we also have an interceptor ship card down here. So we can go and throw in this reduced cooldown afterburner, which is nice. Alright, 
Now, back to my crates. I have one unopened crate remaining. A daily crate here. Thanks for playing today on this wonderful, wonderful 24-hour chunk. And we're going to get uh, a TIE Fighter card, some crafting parts, and a heavy supercharged sentry. That's nice. Um, obviously, these things are purchasable. Not going to do it right now. One guaranteed trooper or hero, two mystery. One guaranteed trooper, two other. One guaranteed starfighters. There's like a flying one, a ground one, and then a super duper one. Uh, let's see what else we have going on here. Don't miss out. Get Yoda's epic lightsaber. That's for pre-ordering. Um, if we go back to play, which is the tab I want to do, let's check out the other arcade solo. These can be played co-op, and there also is going to be head-to-head -head arcade, so I'm guessing, like, you can try and take out Darth Maul. Um, but we do have these two battle scenarios on the dark side, so let's go see what Roger Roger is. The Separatist assault on Naboo has begun. Your unit of Separatist battle droids is ordered to take the throne room by force. Crush the clone troopers, protect your unit, you are not programmed for failure. That would be fun to start with the single-player stuff, just because I know that everybody is kind of doing multiplayer as their main, main beginner. Uh, and I wanted to kind of do something a little different. Alrighty, so, we've got this beautiful little droid. Man, we can go Assault, we can go Heavy, we can go Officer, we can go Specialist. Um, I kind of, let's, okay, since we have the Health Regen, the Assault, and you can see our abilities here. Thermal Detonator, Vanguard, and then we have Combat Enhancer, uh, which is pretty cool. Let's rock the Assault class and see what we got. Getting some, some shooter action up in here. Yes, and this is Battlefront as I remember, which I really like Battlefront. I think it has a, a unique style, and I'm glad it doesn't feel just like Call of Duty. Like, I think it's important uh, that your game, you know, whoa, that was a tough, a very far toss, my friend. I think it's important that uh, your game feels different. We've taken the lead, and we're gonna, we gotta push onto the throne room, right? That's where we gotta go. Let's go. 69 kills remaining. Holy guacalaca. That's a lot of freaking blood that we are gonna be putting out. This gun... Uh, by the way, is having some serious trouble, and I'm now dead. All right, so I have to remember that uh, these blasters overheat, and they need to be they need to be ventilated properly. So we'll drop back in, and we'll we'll rock assault one more time. Drop in with this ROKG dude, and we got to defeat the clone army. So this is kind of like almost like a practice scenario for multiplayer. I wonder if we can get points out of it, or how it's gonna work. Let's see. All right, so we want to make sure that we don't overheat. You can see our heat meter up there, right above our, uh... Whoa, whoa, Nelly. Okay, good. Three-player streak. Go for those headshots. All right, I'm overheated. I'm overheated. Ow, I burned myself. I got hit on the blue. All right, 50 kills remaining. There we go. That's good. Wow, okay. Let's, let's throw a grenade. Gosh, toss those grenades. That guy, like, home run hit it out of the stadium. There we go. Seven-player streak. This little hallway is pretty nice. Um... Close oh yeah, I like that. Look at that. That's pretty cool. Close attack, killing power. All right, 40 kills remaining. I I like these scenarios in Battlefront One. I hope that there's there's more of them and they're more varied in Battlefront Two, because it was a pretty fun way to play. Like being able to play by yourself and kind of learn some of the maps, learn some of the different guns. I like that. And then also with the cooperative stuff, uh, where you could compete with another another person um, to try and like. Survive the waves. I like that kind of stuff. I like horde modes and things of that nature. So I hope that they have quite a bit of that here. All right, cool. Vent, vent the systems. Oh jeez, wow, those are about to. Hey, yeah, watch your shield. I'm trying to shoot this guy. All right, let's see. Fifty troops remaining. Who am I getting shot by? All right, I lose my power. Goodness gracious! All right, there we go. A nice little fifteen streak there. Top player takedown. And the kill streak. Let's get back in the action. Let's try the heavy. See how this works. We'll get to go through all the classes, which is pretty darn fun. All right. Defeat the clone army. Doing our darndest to make magic happen. Oh, yes. Okay, there we go. I like that. I like that. This guy doesn't even see what's coming. Ooh, nice shield. Nice shield. Not going to last you too long here. I have a shield of my own. I'm going to throw that up. It's pretty good. Out and I'm out. All right, they completely overwhelmed me, but they're down to only 13 dudes, so we'll drop back in as a heavy and see how this goes. I think we'll get some multiplayer in here as well. We're we're kind of cruising through these these little uh, arcade stages, so I'm I'm down to bring even more action. And I think checking out multiplayer would be the next the next thing to do, right? Got him. Sentry mode activate. Yeah, buddy. Five kills remaining. 
throw up that shield. I love that we're just a little, little, little cool joy doing our, doing our work here. All right, so that's a pretty cool grenade. Nice. Okay, there's a dude definitely behind me. Or in. Wow! Holy macaroni! We have been mutilated, but I think the battle has been beat. Victory is ours. There we go. That's how I like to get it done. Job well done. Job well done. All right. Only a star. That's just how they like to do us. All right, let's check it out. Um, all righty, so that's the arcade stages. Let's jump into multiplayer. And I think what we should definitely do is check out the Starfighter Assault. I think that's what we want to do, right? We want to see outer space action. Put the freaking air pedal to the metal. The, the air... The air grind on your mind. That's what... Okay, we're going to Fondor. The Imperial Shipyard. The Star Destroyer is undergoing repairs. The maintenance cycle about Fondor. The Rebel Alliance launches a surprise assault to destroy. I just want to see how different this feels. Because if you remember, the space aerial combat in Battlefront 1 was okay, but it was very... It felt like you were kind of on like a Disney ride. Um, we got the Interceptor. We got the Bomber. We have the Fighter. I'm just going to start with the Fighter because it's just so traditional and we got to see. Uh, Astromech Repair on L1. Proton Torpedo. And then Weapon Overcharge on the Double Trouble. All right, so we're going to drop in here in about five seconds. We got a squad. And this looks so freaking glorious. Gosh, I remember... Listen to this. Yeah, the, uh, the, the first... Okay. Oh, hey. That was, that was good. Four battle... Uh, what I was trying to say, though, was that the, um, the, the first game I ever got for Nintendo GameCube was Rogue Squadron 2. And I remember being worried, like, if it was going to be cool or not. And then I, I played it on, uh, I got, got the system home when I played it, and I had so much freaking fun. I was like, okay, this game is actually pretty good. The graphics are good. You know, obviously it was a long time ago. All right, let's see. So this feels a whole lot more open than what I remember. There we go. Doctor Who has been eliminated. Okay, so I can, like, shoot a freaking proton torpedo at this guy. There we go. Yep, let's go all in. Okay, and I literally just crashed myself into it. Did that do some good damage? I did get 429 battle points. Alright, I gotta learn, because, like, left stick is speed, and then I guess right stick is totally aiming. This is interesting. Okay, full deploying on this group. So, okay, left stick is left stick is turn and speed, and then right stick is, like, okay, it's a little bit, it's a little odd, just in terms of, like, how you're, how you're actually facing off against these foes. So we want to shoot in the circle to damage... There we go. Nice assist. So you're looking for the circle. So it, it is similar, but it's definitely way more open. And you have way more, like, I feel like opportunity to be awesome. And I'm going to have to learn all of the, like, you know, like, let's spin and mess the controls. Oh, God. Uh, heal me. And, yeah, I've been I've been blown up. Dual proton torpedoes. That did not feel good. Let's try out a different, uh, a different ship. Let's go with this interceptor here. Um, let's see what it does real quick. Target lock, not lose your target, afterburner, and then concussion missile. Okay, I like that. Let's rock with this and see what we can do. God, it looks gorgeous though, doesn't it? I can lock in here. I'm playing the objective. Thank you for appreciating my objective plane. Fire concussive missile at this ship. Okay. So we gotta get out of here. Woo! We've been we've been defeated. All right, that's a good little taste of it as they take us down. And I kind of like the idea that this episode is just, We've since it's like the first, to fight another day. it's giving you the taste of everything. So that's the aerial combat, the above the stars combat. Obviously, I was no MVP, uh, but got a decent feel for it. It's going to take a little time just because you are flying in kind of a different fashion. Uh, but we picked up a kill, picked up an assist. And let's take things to the ground and just give you a little smorgasbord of all of it. All right, we're going to roll into a strike, see how that handles itself. And I figured I would just make the first video again, like all modes, everything available in the beta. Um, and then we can specify and kind of get granular. I obviously know I'm no pro and not going for a top score here. I just want to kind of see everything that's going on. This is Maz's castle. Um, so we've seen the Thede Palace. 
uh, Galactic Assault. Now we have the First Order have intel that Maz's castle might be the location of a sought-after Jedi artifact, but the Resistance aren't going to let them take it without a fight, so we're either going to be assaulting the castle looking for said artifact, or defending the castle preventing it. Alrighty, so we're about to begin this match. I actually am going to load in as the officer this time. It looks pretty interesting. If we get enough points, uh, we can drop in as a Rocket Jumper or a Wookiee Warrior, but first up, we have Battle Command, which allows our squad to withstand more damage. Flash Grenade, that can be split. Uh, and a blaster turret. Flash order got wind of an artifact here in Takodana, and they're sure to do everything they can to get it. Protect the package and do not let it reach the extraction point. All right, so here's our artifact inside of the cantina here. You guys remember this scene from Episode Seven? It's pretty darn awesome that they are bringing all the eras in. I really like that idea. I think it's really freaking cool, and I can't wait to see what they do with Episode Eight. I'm hoping that that movie is just amazing. It comes out right by my birthday, so it would be a, a lovely gift for me. I thought 7 was okay. I'm definitely hoping for more. Where are these assaulters? Stop the First Order from stealing the artifact. They must be way out there in the forest. We got doves flying. Enemy troop is picked up what? Really? And that guy's already destroying stuff. How did they... Oh, wow. Look at that. They, they somehow, like, snuck in here. I can't even see them. How did you do it? How did they get so sneaky like that? Is there a side door? There's gotta be, there's always a side door, right? Thanks. I love my side door action. Enemy has dropped the package. Good. Package has been dropped. Got him. There we go. Eliminated. I uh, am, okay, there, oh gosh. We gotta do like really close by. Out, no. Oh, backstabbed by Riggs. He just took it right to me. All right, so that scout is actually pretty cool just because of his distance. Um, I'm also going to try the special. Let's just roll through all the classes, right? We're, like, doing just about everything in the beta, so why the heck not? All right, um, stop them from escaping. Defend the extraction point. But, oh, wow. Okay. Gotcha! All right, I like this. I don't. I didn't see what all of my abilities are. Um... But I do... We got the package secured, which is good. The Wait, now they have it again. What punks? Alright. Okay, this is not good. It's not good at all. Grenade out. Oh, I threw that grenade too far. Yikes. And yeah. Holy cow, the Death Stealer got me. But I got a couple good kills there. Nice little streak, some battle point action. Remember, if I can get 3,000, I can cash them in to a Wookiee Warrior. The issue is, will they take that artifact to the extraction zone before I can even Wookiee up? Um, okay, yeah, that's where they are. Here's the artifact. And they escaped. All right, flip sides. Let, let us try to attack. Goodness gracious, teamwork. Is something that we could use a whole lot more of here in this beta. Wow. How did my team do? Okay, I was almost top of the squad with four eliminations. They got out of there real quick. I had the most kills and the most damage dealt. But we got another round coming right at you. So we'll kick it right back with one more of those strike uh, sessions since that was so short. All right, we're going to try things out as the First Order themselves rocking them stormtrooper helmets. From the resistance here on Takadana. Obtain the package and bring it to the extraction point. Let's see if our squad can do what that last squad did. Enter Maz's castle, steal the artifact, and escape before a hundred tickets are burned, before a hundred helmets are smashed and bashed and crashed. We have the advantage of knowing where that artifact is. There is is that a Wookiee already? I was like, what? Whoa, there's a dude dropping in. There's some people. Oh, someone has lit up exactly where everybody's at. That's nifty. And you can see this guy. Look at this. Look at these guys. Look at these Punkasauruses. All right. This one right here. You're going to have to go. I got an elimination, and then the Colts took me out. That's rare because the Indianapolis Colts don't really do that much damage. I'm actually going to rock the officer. I like their little pistol action. I like the distance, the range, the power. And I like their little support ability. So let's see what we can do. Um, they are really... Eating us alive at this uh, place here. Let's crouch. Can we? Hello? Mm -hmm. Anybody in here? Oh, it looks like we've stolen it. Okay, good. Let's let's run with him then. 
We're going to the forest already. This is, man, you get that artifact quickly, you can get out of here real nice and fast. They've got people assaulting. Oh, here, this guy. Yep, you are going to be dead. Good kill. Good kill. And that definitely took a toll on my health, but it should be back soon. Um, the artifact is over here. Get the artifact to safely. Health actually recovers pretty quickly. Uh, if you do notice that. Uh, this dude here. Here, I'm going to help you out. Let's go. You should have a little bit of a... A little bit of a boost from you. Let's throw a, let's throw that down. Turret support deployed. Let's see what we can do with that. Um, a little turret support there. Kind of just... I'm going to kind of trail and follow my dude. If I can't be the main man... Oh, give me that artifact. Alright, I got it. I got it. I got it. Can I have it? Got it. Oh, God. Okay. Nope. Nope. There is someone with a sniper. And I've been... Uh, they were right there. You didn't even see them. They lurked in the leaves and then came just as they pleased. All right. Um, I kind of want to go heavy. Figure we just try a lot of variety of this episode. We pushed it really, really good. Now, if they can return the timer to zero, it'll retreat back to the castle. Or if we can keep the pressure on, then we may be able to make some magic happen and continue our push. Okay, good. One of our four... I think that's our guys. Yeah, shoot me in the... There, okay, there we go. Cool down, cool down. They're lobbing grenades, and grenades can go really far in this game. They're bouncing around like freaking Donkey Kong. That may not have been the smartest idea. Where is this dude at? Oh, there. See him? Ah, alright. Got him. Okay. Somebody else is really close by. Maybe this is ridiculous, but I'm gonna move it. I moved it five feet! It's not how this is supposed to work. Alright, um... I'm gonna stick with the assault for a little bit. Let's see what we got. We can also switch their weapons out. But I looked pre-match, like, between, and it didn't seem like the best idea. Alright, um, as... Whoa. As you know... Uh, as... As you... No. Okay. As you know, I have that extra health. <laughs> health! Okay, health doesn't matter if you can't jump. Um, it looked like there was someone coming from behind. Anybody in the castle? No, they're all... All working their way, but I'm gonna kinda try to come from behind where they're at, because they gotta be defending this point. Right, you'd think? There's just a trooper. Someone's shooting me from behind. Roll! Give me that health. Okay. No! They took it back to the castle. I saved my life with a little help burst there. Um... Where is this dude that's like... Uh, I think he's coming around here. Or up up through there. Yeah, that was really not worth worrying about. Okay, good. So this guy has stolen and is moving up. Because I think they were all over at this part of the map. So probably having a hard time rushing back. You can hear the little pitter patter of their guns. It's just like, where are they? Nobody's coming out of the castle as of yet. Oh, someone's really close. Oh, hey. Look at this dude. Okay, I'm gonna trust that my teammate took that person out. I'm assuming they did. We're running through the back again. Oh, 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 oh. Alright. Okay, got some decent- oh, hello. Yes! In the Battle of the Short Rangers, we somehow won. That was insane. I got like so quiet, I was like, what is happening? Okay, there's a bunch of guys around here. Good hit. Okay, alright. We're making our way towards the artifact. Trooper up there, doing work. You can see we, we've got 457 battle points queued up. Good. Another guy from behind. Oh, another guy coming up the mountain. Ridge warriors are coming. Here they come. Are they waiting for us? I don't know what they're up to. Yep. Yep. All right, good teamwork. This is intense. I like this. Ouch. Yeah. Get it. Got it. Okay. I'm gonna take it back. Um, I need to get it. Oh god, no! 
No! How Man, these dudes just somehow like sneak up on me. I'm like, I don't even know sure where I got at. Uh, but we can bring in... Oh, I'm so close to the incinerator. That's going to be awesome. So we'll get that before this battle is over, which will be good news. All right. This is getting pretty intense and exciting. I picked up the artifact, saved us a little bit of time. But not enough. We got to get it to the extraction point, my friends. I have to. Hey, listen, listen, listen. Oh, I shot, how much? Look at that dude with 30, okay, good, I was gonna say. That better be an elimination. Bring in the freaking, do we wanna be the rocket trooper? No, we wanna be the incinerator. First order flame trooper. This is gonna be awesome. Whew. It's not a straight up villain like a Kylo or a Darth Maul, but it is a dude with a big flame thrower. I'm gonna actually head back this way and provide support if we can pick it up. I got flame tanks, I got heals. I got lots of good stuff. Um, the meter still is about half the time, so let's actually go up through the canyons and see if that may be a better place to provide heavy assault support. Although being up on a ridge does not seem like this guy's ideal play. Oh, wow. I'm too far. I'm too far. I'm too far. No! Burn him! Goodness gracious. I let that guy on fire, and I died, so you gotta be really careful. Apparently, do not have enough, a lot of health when you're one of those dudes. I'm sorry if you feel like I burned that. Take me too. Didn't mean to at all, but this is intense. I think they took the package back. Dang it, they did. All right. So, yeah. The package has been picked up by our forces. That is tough. Those guys go out so quick, and especially that flame trooper. You blow those battle points. It's, it's not like a Jedi. You can just, like, got him. Okay. Turret with Throw that turret down right there. That might help. can hold R1 to self-destruct it. Getting that health regen. Oh, the artifact was dropped already? Man. Interesting that it got dropped, like, right here. I'm, I'm damaging quite a few goons with that. Good. So i like to see. Can you pick it up? Good. See this guy? Yikes. Okay. Come on. Come on. Did 208 damage there. And a kill assist. Okay, good. Good. Oh, there's still one more dude. I'll try to provide cover. It's, it's right over here. As long as we just scare him off a little. Ah, oh, didn't see that dude lurking. This is much better. Now, obviously, the last battle was so quick. They beat us almost instantaneously. But this one, win or lose, is a whole lot more fun just because there's an intensity about it that I really like. All right, so it's going to return to the castle. I'm actually going to grab it myself. What the heck is happening? Shoot this person. Good. Thank goodness. All right, I'm going to go grab it. You got it? Okay, good. We cool, we cool. People are trying to come in and help take it, but I, I don't really want to let them. All right. Oh! There's my grenade. Eh, it didn't work so well. All right, let's actually, you know what? Actually, I'll provide support from the center here. Inevitably, the rocket trooper. Look at this guy. Look at this punk. Look at this guy. Got him. All right, cool. That's important. Those are kills that are going to help move us up the map. And that's what we got to do. We only have 27 tickets left, so this is dangerous. Oh, jeez. Someone's really close. Oh, there. Got him. Good kill. Okay, push this package. Come on, artifact. Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. Who's here? Who's here? Who's here? It's a rocket. It looks like somebody up, up high. Did you see this? I, I swear I saw someone flying above. Package has been intercepted. No! Freak of nature. Okay. Good. Nope. Bad. Dang it. Got an elimination. Quite a few battle Let's points. I don't know if it's enough, though. Alright, we're back in it. We only have 18 tickets. The artifact is out here. I really like the, uh, the freaking rocket boost jump. It would help for a lot of these ledges. Okay. You got it? Oh, jeez. Who is... Oh, you see that guy? Yeah. Okay. Pop our health.
Good. Man down. Package dropped. No! I'm down to 13 tickets. And these rooftop warriors are really, like, hurting us. Got him. Good. Got it. Go, 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 go. Go, go, go. All right. Got to run it up the canyon here. And even if we don't get it all the way... Kind of just getting it close, even. No! No, that guy was, like, literally just waiting. Oh, my God. He sniped. <laughs> he freaking knew exactly where I was. We only have 11 tickets. It's so close. I mean, it's not that close. It's, like, 100-ish meters. Dang. I really like this mode, though. This will be so fun with friends to, like, coordinate. And then you can actually, like, hey, okay, I've got... The freaking incinerator, please help defend me so I don't die like in one second, because that's never fun. We are running out of opportunities. Finish the job. Yes, I see, I see, I see. Got him. Grenade him. Yep. Got him. You got it? Artifact? We got it? Let's go. Okay. Maybe we get some overtime action. Let's move it. No, golly. Get in the mission area. Let's go. Let's go. Oh, my God. No. No. So close. All right. I have a bunch of points. Um, let's be a rocket trooper. I only have three, two tickets left. Am I even going to spawn in? Good. Okay. Alright. Cool, cool, cool. Yes, let's go. Oh, that's so freaking awesome. Go, 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 buddy. Overtime. There we go. No! Oh my god, the rocket trooper is so cool. I know I died. That was so freaking awesome. We're probably going to lose this match, but that was freaking cool. No! I can spawn back in as a rocket trooper. Come on, try to help him, try to help him, try to help him, try to help him. Okay, go, 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 go. We got it. Oh my goodness. I love this rocket trooper so much. That's so fun. No! Yes. Oh god! Holy cow. Trying my best, but it's tough when there's overtime. And we're just, we got a whole lot of points with that guy. He's really good at picking up points, especially with that rocket barrage. Pretty freaking awesome. Oh, God. It's literally so close. It's so close, but it might be too freaking far. Someone's got to get to it, and they are heavy blast. Oh, ah. Got an elimination. Stop the kill streak. Not enough for a rocket trooper, though. Actually, you know what I should be? I should be a specialist. Oh, overtime is gonna... We're so close. You can see how close it was. No, 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 no. Alright, so we got defeated, but that was absolutely epic. I freaking love that. Basically, like a full, full maximum power mission there. That was awesome. I really like that. Did I, did I podium? Yeah, no, I did not. They were all awesome. But uh, we did pretty darn good for our own team, 14 eliminations, and we're cruising and bruising to the next rank. Uh, I'm going to dip out of this, actually, as we acquire our XP, and we're going to get a little peek at the last aspect of the beta, which is that Galactic Assault. Now, obviously, you've probably seen it if you played at or, or watched at E3, um, but I just want to make sure that we cover every base in this beta video so that you know what's up. Alrighty, one more time with feeling. Look at all these vehicles. Galactic Assault has a whole lot of options. Boba Fett, Darth Maul, B2, Super Droids. But we're going to start off just the regular Assault class droid here and dump in. It's a brand new mission, or a brand new match, I guess. So there's still a couple of seconds. Um, I got some more crates from playing. I'll save those for the next video. And make sure to let me know as we enter this last portion of the beta and the last, last portion of the video what you want to see next time. I will bring it your way if you want to see a focus on the heroes and villains, if you want to see a focus on leveling up, if you want to see a focus on full matches, on space combat, on just exciting moments, on playing with friends, whatever you want to see, let me know in the comments down below and I'll bring it to you. But this will be our, uh, our final thing. 
And it should be a good one because this is a gorgeous, glorious map in a gorgeous, glorious game. I played it at 83, and now I'm playing it at home for the second time. Look at this beauty. This is so cool. Don't shoot the people. Come on, droids. Gosh, they're evil. Look at it. Look, don't shoot the innocents. What are you guys doing? All right. All right, so there's ion disruptors over here. They're currently locked up, and we got to push to the palace. That's kind of the plan of the day. Oh, wow. Some, uh, yikes. Droids have been destroyed. That's kind of the way this goes. Evil dudes like to eat us up. That's all right. We'll drop right back in. There's not a whole lot of penalty uh, for putting yourself in a perilous position. Although, obviously, ideally, you don't die. Um, especially in that last kind of mode that we saw. Um, but here, it's not as important. Now, I played on PC at E3. And, like, it did look better on PC. But it still looks, like, incredibly good here on console. I can't... I can't even tell you otherwise. Like, it, it does look really, really good. Look at this. Okay, kill assist for a kill assist. Give me some battle points. I'm not really quite sure what my my teammate was doing there. Let's go with the, let's go with the battle droid officer. I like, give the little pistol, the little droid. I think that's a good way to go. All right, more bonus score if we're close to our teammates. All right, so this is the MTT that we're defending, and that's the health that we're uh, we're worried about. Um, this alleyway is clearly a critical one. The droids are trying to push it, as you can see. Ion disruptors activating. Oh, look at this guy! Do you see that dude battle roll over here? Nice kill, nice kill. I guess kind of the point is just to fire rapidly and see what you can find. Uh, see what you can get your gun locked in on. Even if it's only a little bit of damage, it could be the could be the last bit of damage that gets the kill. And they're definitely going to come from this side. Gotcha. Okay, cool. Let's uh, throw this down here. Good luck, turret. Good luck, turret. I like that a lot. I like I like wishing the turret good luck. Oh, look at this guy. Okay. Defend. Deal some damage. Got a nice kill. So you can see some people across the way. Oh, I think those are just innocents, though. Okay. All right, so our turret has provided a little bit of an oom for us here. Oh, yikes. Ooh. That dude walked right into my truck. I'll take the kill assist, though. Um, okay. This is an insane battle. There's just so much happening. So many droids, so much power. See this guy across the way there? Not really doing much damage to him, but hey. Sometimes a little bit is all you need, like we mentioned. Alright, there's dudes up that way. Good, waypoints are what we want. Yes, my overlord, I want waypoints. That's good. Continue to push into enemy territory, and we're going to make our way to Feed Palace. Let me, know, let me know what you guys think of the length of the video. Like, I, I decided to go for a big one for this first one, just because I know people are pumped for the game. I'm pumped for the game. I wanted to see all the debate I had to offer, and that way you'd know if you're going to download it, uh, what you can expect. Or if you can't download it, or if you're not home, or if you don't have the bandwidth, or if your PS4 is full, or you don't have a PS4, or if you're waiting to get a PS4 for this game, or an Xbox One, or a PC. I wish I could say, or a Switch, but it's not on Switch. Uh, and now you'll have some good intel on what's going on but let me know what you want to see we'll probably do a more specific specified video next time around which will be fun yes two player kill streak there extra damage a lot of battle points good gets um, i'm actually gonna ooh, let's go with specialist I, I always like sniping it's always tricky but if you can get it good it feels oh so fine so as we push towards this uh this place Whatever. The palace, I guess. Push to the palace. Our MTT is just rocking and rolling right through, which is good. Doesn't even seem like anybody's near it. We passed that first waypoint, so we're making our way. Oh, you can see there's a ship up in the sky. Someone's spending a lot of points on that bad boy. Um, okay, ion disruptor. 
starting to hear some gunfire, starting to hear some shots. Little baby droid. Oh, yes. Gotcha. Oh, wow. Wow. What'd that guy hit me with? Jet Trooper. One shot, one kill. That was insane. All right, I could be this. I could be this. You can be bombers. Uh, it's 5K, though, for the real heroes or the real villains, I guess. Um, I'm gonna I'm gonna stick with the officer. I don't know. The sniper is a little just probably too too specific for what I want to do right here. So we got some crossfire happening. This is actually where we, we met our death last time, if you recall. Some dudes behind. Where are they at? Where are they at? Up in this ridge, clearly. Mm -hmm, there we go. Super important to get this guy. Yep, got him. Okay. Did not need to waste the grenade there. But yes. Okay, we'll self destruct the turret just to give ourselves a chance to uh, pick it back up. Alright, let's push. We go. The this guy has to die, right? Got him. Thank goodness. Ooh, nice kill. Whoever helped me out there, thank you. And throw a turret down there. Watch out, watch out. Good kill, team. Alright, and we're gonna keep pushing to the palace. That's the whole goal here. Oh, MTT is not doing so hot. It's having some troubles. Feeling a little pain train here, but it's really making an aggressive push now. Targeting grenade. Okay, I wasn't sure if there's a dude uh, right around the corner. If there was, I, I oh god, and he was behind. Dang, nab it. All right, we're at 2,000, so we could pick up uh, this BP. Increase protective measures. Do we want to be the super? I get, let's get a few more points and be the super. Let's not. I'd rather live longer than uh, live quicker. So let's let's do that. The MTT is pushing. I wonder like how far it has to push. I mean, it's it's getting pretty close to the palace, right? It's up there. You can see the palace in range. Ooh, an ion disruptor l launched. Oh god. Got him. Good teamwork there. I'll take the battle points, you know that. We need that stuff. We need that juice. Okay, there's someone right around the corner here. Stop with the ion disruptors. Yep, there we go, good. Whoever that is. Shoot him through the freaking... Ow, I burned my finger. I burned my finger. It's like a... How am I not hitting that guy? There we go. I was about to say. Give me that kill. Alright. Got him. Okay. Got him. Let's go. We're making our way to this palace. Let's get in the palace. Nope, that's not the way in. Hey! Hey, are you kidding me? Oh my god. Nobody, nobody told me that guy was right there! Alright, 3,000 battle points though. I'm gonna... Okay, let's just wait and get Maul. I... I really kind of want to be the battle droid, but let's just wait and get Maul and make this video end with a bang. Uh, for those of you that got this far, goodness gracious, you're awesome. Destination reach for the MTT. And the palace is open, so... Okay, why does that not count as the mission area? We have to go through the center. Alright, we crash through. That's good. The MTT is in position. I don't think we can. Can we go up here? Okay, now we finally can the go through. Good. Alright. Whoa! Kylo! I mean, Ray! Goodness gracious. Ray's lightsaber. But I did some I did some damage. Alright, we're gonna go to an assault since we're in close quarters now. Not gonna be as intense from the outside. Grenade 
Alright. Shut down the palace security system. You saw that based on the health of our MTT, that affected how many uh, tickets we got, how many lives we got. We're already down to 60, so we do need to be careful here. Okay. Yikes, I almost was going to come in with that special, but he had such a good grenade. We're at 3,600, 1,400 more. Can our, squ our, oh, our squad is definitely going to survive long enough to be Maul, right? That just has to happen. All right, West Door Control, we're working on it. Let's let's try to double trouble them. I feel like if we attack both at once, it'll be much more uh, much more difficult for them to, to mess with. Uh, where are we? Hello? West override approaching completion. Where are we at? There we go. All right, I was like, where's the door? Somebody big is in here. Yikes, okay. Boba Fett is coming in. Who else is in here that's causing so much chaos? Yikes. Got a kill assist there. 600. All right, we're, we're a little bit away from Maul, as you can see. Uh, we're very, very close. They've got, they've got Ray and Han Solo. That's who we have to watch out for. Watch this. All right, the west door is done. So that's good. We only have 36 though. I'm guessing we'll get more once we override this. That's my theory. Okay. Wow. Yeah. Defeated. <laughs> oh, 4908. I like how it said defeated. I legit got scared for a second that our whole team was done. The good news is... Yeah, it sounds like we pushed the doors. Yep, now we're in the palace. and we'll get Yes. So when Darth Maul comes in, it's going to be all awesome. Okay. Move to that throne room, baby. Yep, there's Maul making madness. There's us killing dudes on the stairwell. Here's us running back so that we don't get attacked from behind. I think a little side, little uh, flank approach here might be nice. Okay, we can push up into here. What do we got around the corner? This guy. Good way to help. Um, there's a Wookie. There's a Wookie. Good deal. We got battle droids. We got big things, and we got someone coming from the side here. Seems like oh, there's no door though. Okay, so we're safe. We're safe. Yikes! I caramba. That's a lot of stuff going on there. Ooh, wow. Double takedown. I don't know what that guy used. Uh, but I'm at 5,500. Okay, I could be Boba. I really want to be Maul. But we got to be Maul earlier, so let's be Boba Fett. Let's rock Boba Fett. He has for the hunt. Uh, enemies are revealed. Rocket barrage. A concussive shot. Let's do it. I wanted Maul, but it's okay. Boba Fett, I think, will be a pretty good guy to get. And he's got his, he's got his, bla his uh, jet pack, so that should be fun. Okay, I want to go around to the side. I don't want to push directly in. I think that's just a fool's there. Look, I love how his little cape flies around. That is awesome. All right. Okay. Got him. Doors are locked. They've locked us out. Who's left? Who's here? This is just the throne room where we want to be. The question is, where are the enemies? Oh, they're coming in there. Fire that concussive shot. Rocket barrage. All right. Oh, golly goodness. I'm just firing rockets every which way. We secured the throne room. Victory is ours. So Boba Fett helped contribute to the victory there. Didn't do a whole lot as the big bounty hunter. 
but we did get the victory and that's gonna be our first look at the battlefront two multiplayer madness and a little bit of that single player arcade did pretty good like I said, I'm no pro. I have a lot of fun with this, though. And I'm sure the more that we play, the better we'll do. I could have got way more eliminations, uh, I guess, if I was more aggressive. Or if I was in vehicles. Or if I was at the front. Or if I didn't keep getting assists. I had 15 assists. A lot of assists. Uh, but we'll get better. We had fun. Hopefully you guys enjoyed seeing all the action. If you want to see more, let me know in the comments down below. I'll bring it your way. You want to see something specific? Definitely keep me posted. You can follow me on Twitter. Twitter.com slash GhostRobo. And I will read there as well what we need, what we want. And we'll come at you with more Battlefront 2. Until that time, everybody, thanks so much for watching. That's the day. Drink so much. I love you all. And we'll see you all later.